In this tutorial, we will learn how to calculate cube root of any number by the prime factorization method. So first of all, let's have a number. Um, we are taking 125. Now all you have to do is prime factorize it. So we cannot divide it by 2 since we have 5 in the last. So we will have, we will divide it by 5. Now we will get 25. We will divide it again by 5 then we get 5 divide it again by 5 and we will get 1 so we are getting 5 3 times so whenever you are calculating cube root then you should know that the factors should be in the group of 3 so we have 5 3 times so cube root of 3 125 equals to Five. Just to verify it, you can try to multiply it again. It will be 125. So this is how we calculate cube root of any number using the prime factorization method. Let's take another example. We have 64. Let's divide it by 2. We get 32 again divided by 2 we get 16 again divided by 2 we get 8 again divided by 2 we get 4 again divided by 2 we get 2 then again 1 so we are having 2 6 times or we can say we get this and this so 4 so cube root of 64 is 4 so always keep in mind that whenever you are calculating square root then it will be in pairs of 2 the factors will be in pairs of 2's and when you are calculating cube root then it will be the factors will be in the group of 3 so since we have 2 groups of 2's so it is 4 so this is how we calculate cube roots of any number using the prime factorization method. Thank you for watching the tutorial. Please don't forget to click on the subscribe button for receiving more updates from being skilled.